So for this song, we need a version of C, G, D, A, and E. So for C, we want to place our first finger on the first fret second string, and our second finger on the second fret fourth string. And we're strumming from the fourth string down. For G, we want to place our third finger on the third fret first string, and we're strumming from the fourth string down. For D, we want to place our first finger on the second fret third string, our second finger on the second fret first string, and our third finger on the third fret second string. And again, we're strumming from the fourth string down. For A, we want to place our first finger on the second fret fourth string, our second finger on the second fret third string, and our third finger on the second fret second string. And we're strumming from the fifth string down. Finally, for E, we want to place our first finger on the first fret third string, our second finger on the second fret fifth string, and our third finger on the second fret fourth string. And this time we're strumming all of the strings. So now let's have a look at the intro. We want to play a fifth fret on the second string and we want to play the first string open. Then we want to play the third fret on the second string and play the first string open. Then we want to play the second and third string open and then the third and second string open. So that's fifth, third, open, and the second and third open. And then after that, we play an E chord for four counts. And then an E chord again for four counts. So all together, that's five, three, open, open, E, E, three, four, E, two, three, four. One more time. Five, three, open, open, E, two, three, four, E. We need C, G, D, and A, and they're all worth two counts each. So it's C two, G two, D two, A two, and then we play E, and that's for three counts. E two three, and then we play third fret sixth string, open sixth string, and that's for two counts. And then finally, we play strings three, two, and one, while still in that E shape, and that's for two counts as well. One, two. Okay. So all together, that's C, two, G, two, D, two, A, two, E, two, three, three, open, two, strong, two. And then we just repeat that again for the last part of A. So for part B, you repeat that sequence again. So it's C2, G2, D2, A2, E2, 3, 3, open 2, strum 2. Then for the second part of B, we play 3rd fret 5th string, then 3rd fret 6th string, and then we have two counts each. And then we play open on the 4th string, and open on the 5th string. And they're worth two counts each. So together it's three, two, three, two, open two, open two. And then we finish it off with the E strum and then the three open. So E, two, three, three, open two, three, four. So all together we have five, three, open, open, E, two, three, four, E, 